Hello and welcome to Reacting Mass Calculations. There are three of these, please look at all of them because there's lots of different possibilities. So this one is about titanium, hence this beautiful picture here where a hip replacement is made out of titanium. Just putting it into context for you there. Right, so we've got what mass of titanium chloride, this thing here, reacts to form 70 grams of titanium, which is this thing here. So they're asking you, the mass of their reactant because these are the reactants and these are the products. Now, first off, the same with all these, you cross out what you don't need. So if we're looking at this question, what mass of titanium chloride, that one, reacts to form titanium, that means we don't need that and we don't need that. Now, remember, you only need one thing on each side, otherwise it's all gone wrong. So anyway. So now we need to look at the MR, or the mass of this job here. So this is titanium chloride. So we need to look at titanium. So titanium is 48, so it's 48. Add four lots of chlorine, which is on mine 35.5. There are better ways of doing this, but I'm just going to do it slowly, slowly. 35.532. There's three of them. That is 490. As easy as that. It's amazing. 190. Ooh. Now, again, use the same unit. It's got in grams, put it in grams. If it says kilograms, put it in kilograms. It doesn't matter. If it says elephants, put it in that. Grams. Big arrow, because we've got rid of all that. Makes titanium. Look that up. That was 48. Fabulous. 48 then of that. Now it says you've got 70 grams. So what we do is make this side one gram, because this is the one we're looking, we've got here, 70 grams, and then we can work this out. So if I divide this by 48 to make it one gram, that will tell me what one, how much it takes to make one gram, then I can times that by 70. So divide that by 48 as well. Do -do -do. Lob that in the calculator. Hundred and oh, she left that. Hundred and ninety divided by forty-eight equals three point nine six. Should we go for three point nine six? Oh, hang on. So that is three point nine six grams makes one gram. Right, now we've got, say, how much to make 70 grams. So if we times it by 70, times 72 equals, times by 70 equals 277.1. 277.1. Point one grams, and that. Shall I, shall I put a smiley face on? Oh, look at that! That's the answer. There you go. So um, sorted. Have a practice. Cheers.